What's poppin' people? Welcome back to another video. This is the first ever Peacock video on my channel, so I'm stoked about it. Not only that, but we got five boys with us today, including me. We have not caught any peacocks before. I've, oh, we went out for an hour and a half last night. I caught my first one technically, but I'm not really counting it. We're saving that for the video, but we actually have some live shiners today. I'll play some clips from the vlog that we filmed at um, this little bait shop. How long have you been in business? I've been in business here for seven years. So I sell pinfish, I sell all these other shiners. I was like, um, uh, deep sea trolling. Yeah, I know. Y'all got the time? I like you people, man. You're a good guy. Hey, man, I'm trying to live, man. I'm trying to live, man. You guys can stay in your own RV. Yeah. 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 You guys can stay in your own RV. You chilling. Best time. You saved the money of renting somewhere yeah. and all that. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. God bless y'all. Be safe, man. Yeah. Yeah. The guy was really nice, cool dude. Got some shiners and uh, to show you guys, since we're in the boat now, um, these are what, what would you say, two inches? At least. Yeah, maybe maybe two inches. Oh decent my, what was that? Was iguana? That, iguana? that was definitely iguana. Nice little shiners. They're about two inches, maybe two and a half. The rigs that we're gonna be throwing today, just a simple little drop shot. We got a one-aught hook right there, a little drop shot weight. We only got about what? I'm filming you, Twinkie. This is, what, this is what we have to deal with all the time. We got about 10 inches um, between the hook and the weight, and that's all we're gonna do. We're pretty much gonna nose hook these shiners right here, which I'll show you guys here in a second on the GoPro. Then we got these boys. We got Hunter. We got Mr. Twinkie over here, Christian himself. It's gonna be a lot of fun. We got A-Dub right here. And then we got Chaz behind the camera. Your boy. Oh God, your boy. <laughs> And uh, we're gonna go ahead and get it started, guys. It's gonna be an awesome episode. Hit the like button. If you guys have been enjoying the content, we're about to drop some crazy videos. Um, also hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. We're gonna hop right into this one. Also, I apologize, it is a little windy today. We're gonna make it work. It's gonna be completely fine. We're gonna probably chill out in these canals for a little bit. We might move out to some of the lakes, which are a far way out this way, but I just think it's gonna be really windy there. We're kind of between the trees and the houses here. It's not too bad. Let's go ahead and rig us up a shiner. Actually, drop his trolling motor so A Dub can cut off this motor. You're good, brother. Let's turn on our graph. All right, boys, you ready, A Dub? Ready? ready? Hey, I'm ready. Hey, you better not leave oh, me hanging, man. Chaz? Oh, yeah, let's get it. All right, so we're going to get me a shiner and we're going to get to work. I'm excited. I am pumped. I am ready, Chaz. You want to do the honors? Let's see what we got, man. You want a big one, small one? Give me a big Mac Daddy, bro. We ain't going for no. We got to make the first peacock a giant. You know what I mean? Peacock. Ooh. I don't really know what like a giant. What is a giant? What is considered a giant peacock? Seven pounds. Seven pounds. Okay. No, that's easily like, like a monster. Is that like a monster? I don't know. You guys drop your comments down below. This is our first time ever. What are you just hooking it through the lip like this? Yeah, I did. Is that what that. you did? Mm -hmm. Both lips or just one lip? Both lips. Yeah, make it hang that's on a little better. So there we go. Let's lip hook the shiner. We are good to go. So to give you guys kind of like a little background, we came out for like, what was it, two hours, hour and a half. You know, we were using artificials, you know, bass lures, and, and the peacock that I did catch was on a chatter bait. And we were just using regular bass baits, nothing crazy. Make sure your drag set too, man. I didn't even check on. Yeah, I think they're gonna be in the middle, like. On the drop off, yeah. yeah. Calling it. You have that hook just lead. Lean up, dude. Don't hook set it. Oh my god, dude! I got one. Yeah, dude, I got one. Dude, I got one. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, dude, he's tugging so hard, baby. Oh, it's a really good one. No, I'm gonna land him. Oh, it's a freaking good one. Oh, my god, beautiful. Oh, yes, dude. We just got started, man. Dude, he broke off my weight. I know he did. Yo! Let's go, dude. Boy, Look boy. at how pretty, yes, dude. Look at how pretty those fish are. Already. Look at that, Christian. Oh, man. That's awesome, bro. You want some pictures? Yeah, dude. I got to get a Look picture. That. Look at that hump right here. <laughs> I'm falling over. Yeah, there's a little hump on his head. You see that? This Look at that is tail. a trip of a lifetime to come out here and catch these beautiful fish like this Heck and to yeah, say man. we can finally catch some peacock bass and we just got started what five, five minutes in five minutes maybe. i don't even know hold on let's see 
How long has my GoPro been filming? Five minutes exactly. Ooh. 502. <laughs> Five minutes in. That's at least a three pounder. Catch a peacock. Oh, dude, let's go. We're gonna get a couple pictures, get the peacock back in the water. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun today. So beautiful, man. And this one doesn't even have the crazy markings. You know, that small one I actually caught last night had better markings. Let's get that girl back in the water. Oh my gosh. Yo, give me some, hey, dog. We about to get back in there. I think we're gonna double up multiple times oh, today. I think we should, yeah. Oh, dude, it's gonna be Especially a blast. If they're tall on it. Oh, yeah, for sure. All right, guys, first fish of the trip. And that is just the start of many fish catches that we're going to be doing. We're going to be doing some saltwater fishing, some deep sea. We're going we're to be doing everything, guys. We're going to be going to some crazy bass lakes, doing a bunch of frogging, flipping, hopefully find some on bed. I mean, this is going to be the trip of a lifetime. So if you guys haven't already, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. It's going to be an awesome trip. Check out Adub's channel down below as well. This is a little smaller shiner, but hey. It is what it is. There we go. Now we're rigged up again. Let's get back in there. AW just had a bite. It's gonna be crazy. I know you guys love the live bait videos and to be live bait fishing for these peas. Oh, this is just dope, man. I feel like we're gonna play around with the live bait for a little bit. And then, like I said, we'll end up probably switching to artificial just to have some fun. Yeah, Christians has a huge large mouth. How big, bro? Go. A freaking big one, dude. Oh my, Christian just got him a stud of a large mouth. That's the solid high three, four pound. Yeah. yeah. Hey, 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 tell him, help, tell him. Couldn't do anything. I was like, I was like, step on something. Yo, Christian, show the camera, bro. Dude, that is so freaking cool. Dude, this thing is like, I got one. No, oh, yo. Peacock too. Is it a peacock? Yeah, oh, a peacock. it is. Oh, look at the markings. It's a small one, I don't care. <laughs> yeah. Heck yeah. Yeah, but look at the markings on him. I bet we could catch him right yeah, here. Yeah, but it's your first peacock, dude. No, I don't care. He's a pretty, like, pretty markings. Dude, I was wondering why that thing was pulling so hard. That He was staying down just digging. I was, I was like, dude, Adam, I said, what did we just say? We were talking about this little tiny, like, left bend. We're like, there's going to be some fish at the mouth of here. And sure oh, enough. Dude. Oh my God, get him, Hunter. Get him. Go, Hunter. Oh. <laughs> oh my. Look at this thing right here. That is giant, dude. That is giant. And I got a hook in my foot. That really hurt. Oh my, dude, that's massive. My power bowl's good? Yeah. Oh, dude, we got giant peacock right here. No. Uh -huh. Freaking Megalodon peacock. I mean, it's probably like the same size as this one hundred you have. I think that one's something. Really? I got one. You got one? Dig it. Oh, yeah. Dude, look at the colors on that. Yeah, that one's cool. That's pretty cool. See that one? You'll See him on the bottom there? And that little. So a little red. Unless you just do you? Heck yeah. Spinning rod. He's bigger than a one pounder. A pretty one. That was a huge shiner too. How did I get this little small one on a big old shiner? Oh gosh. Dude, it's a big one. It's a freaking mega. It's a big one. Oh no, he ain't that big. Dang it. He already gave up. How long is this daggone? There's water bottles in the net. I don't even care. Oh, he came off. Oh, he broke my line. Yo. He got some sharp teeth, I yeah, guess. Yeah. Isn't that not a pretty one, though? Yeah, it's pretty. That is just beautiful, man. That's my second peak, third peacock ever. We can finally say that now. Yeah. <laughs> You know what it is. I said it was a big one, so that's how I went down. Dude, I net. thought it was, man. He felt bigger than that last, but look at this. You see this? And that is just a pretty fish. So I love my standard bass fishing, but this right here is incredible. This is an experience, and we'll remember this one forever. Get this girl back in the water. What would you say, two pounds? God, no. Yeah, I think two. 
Maybe two. He's a really pretty one, though. Yeah, it's really pretty. Like, it's very vibrant, you know? Yeah. All right. Hey, no. 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 Uh -uh. No way. Biggin? No. Small. <laughs> There's that looks like a perch, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, it almost does look like a yellow perch or something. All right, guys, to kind of talk about what we're doing um, or what we were doing. So, you know, we're in these little canals, and uh, you got these banks. You got a lot of rock on them on the edge, and it's a pretty big drop-off. Like, they drop off to nine foot instantly. So right when you come about three, four foot off the bank, you have a nine foot drop off. Now, these peacocks have been on the edge. We haven't really seen any up shallow, but what I noticed yesterday when we came out, we like, I saw a bunch of peacocks swimming out from under the rocks. So what they like to do, and what I've noticed, you know, it's the first time I've ever peacock fished, so I'm trying to understand what the fish do. Um, I was just watching the fish come out of the rocks. So they tuck up in these little boulders and in rock shelves. And uh, those shiners were getting it done. Now we just have this little tiny paddle tail swim bait. I don't know if it's gonna do any good. Probably gonna rig up like a crankbait, something to react to. Like something natural and just see if they eat it you know with their little top waters or something along the bank but you know like i said we they're on the drop off where we've been catching them or they're out in the middle so we're gonna keep on going and uh see what else we can catch it's just a really windy day and we really stayed in the canals we were gonna go right to the lakes but we were like you know what we're staying at the canals so that's what we ended up doing you know we had the problem where we didn't have many shiners left they have how many do you have christian one i think we got two is what i've seen like in the live well swim around all right, do you have a drop shot on? Yeah, I'm about to bring it back up, but I just broke it off. You want to use mine? I'll use this one. All right, he has two shiners. Christian actually hasn't caught one yet. He's lost a few. So I'm going to hop on their boat and show them where me and Chaz were having a ton of bites. And I go over there and see if we can get Christian one. on the last two shiners. I'm just going to hop on their boat and see if we can make it happen. All right, Christian, give us a spiel, man. What you thinking, what you feeling, I'm how you, much totally you live in life? right now. Come to South Florida to catch some peacocks and I end up catching a really nice largemouth, but that's not what we come for. I mean, we come to catch big fish, definitely, but it's not what we come for. I'm trying to catch one of them colorful little critters that swim around down here in the water. And I seen somebody done turn loose some giant goldfish. I don't know what them things are, but them things are like brim on steroids and somebody spray painted them orange. <laughs> they are absolutely massive. I don't know what it takes to catch them, but no one called them chicklets. 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 No, cichlids. Cichlids. No, they're, wait, what are they actually called? <laughs> no, they're cichlids. They're cichlids. Cichlids. I think, they're I called think. cichlids, but I was calling them oh, chicklets. chicklets. <laughs> and we were just going along with it because we didn't know no different. And whoever turned loose all these massive lizards, <laughs> y'all like, get... Like, them things are everywhere. I don't see how people down here live with them. It would freak me out, walk outside and step on a lizard. Uh -uh. <laughs> so I walk in the basement and dang yeah, lizard yeah, staring at All of a sudden, <laughs> stuff takes off like a lizard swam past me and in the water, like a fish. And I'm like, oh, uh, -uh these, I, I wonder how big they get. They probably are huge. But anyway, back to the main topic. I want to catch one so bad. It's been an eventful day. Whole lot more bites than the artificial. That's hilarious. Everybody's seen a lot of Larry. Larry's been strutting his stuff for at least a solid like two and a half hours back and forth on this bridge. Anyway, the peacocks love the shiners. I just can't put it in front of them, I reckon. I, I think I had one, picked up on him. He like took off running. My luck, normal, he come off. Dropped it back down there, caught a nice large mouth. He pulled good. But I really want to catch a peacock. So anyway, stay tuned and we're gonna get it. Where? He's about to shoot him. Where's he at? I don't know where the iguana is, but he's about to shoot it. No way. Oh, I got a fish, bro. Nuh-uh. No way, bro. Oh, it's a freaking toad, Christian. Or is it is at least a three? Yo, let's go. Oh, there goes my shiner. Hey, somebody see if they can dip up my shiner. Yeah, grab that shiner with the net. Just grab it. Get the shiner. <laughs> oh, we'll dude, you got a big one, dude. Let's go. Hey, did you kill the iguana? That's the question. Did you get it? Yeah. That's a good one, too. Dude, that's a beautiful. Bro, finally. Let's go. Yes. Thanks. Yes. Hold it up to them. Dude, that's a good one too, Christian. Let's it's a go. pretty one. Gosh, good Hey, so job. did you get the iguana too? Yeah, we gotta, we gotta ditch it. We need it for bait. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, thank God. You got it. Oh, yes. Hey, guess what, boys? We dropped a bag. Dropped a bag. So Christian finally got him a good one. Finally caught, well, I caught more than this one. Yeah, you caught that one too, yeah, right? Yeah. And then Hunter got just a donkey, oh. dude. That's a four pounder all day. And then that's a solid three and a half pushing four. I mean, you got some you good fish right here, man. No, some good fish.
Mm-hmm.